right, so um, again, we get the uh, cigarette problem. Um, you know, I mean, how, how close I got to get to him uh, for you to, you know, be certain that's what we're talking about. And we still got the gunk all over the ground, um, you know, not cleaned. I, I sent the word around to everybody at the uh, VA, etc. I would hope they would uh, text further along. Um, you know, with the images and the absolute evidence and everything's locked down in the date and time now uh, with cell phones and everything. It's not like the old cameras when you had no idea when a photo was taken. It's 24-7, uh, 365, all that stuff. All this is locked down. So you can hear the uh, jackhammer people are back at it. Uh, again, it's 12.30 uh, p.m. Uh, the 10-10-17, um, uh, October 10th, 2017 the day after uh, Columbus Day. And um, virtually none of the conditions have changed in the last, um, you know, uh, two and a half hours since I last shot a video like this. And that includes the other bathroom across the way. Again, this is the Telltale Stain, a Winton Hotel, 445 O'Farrell Street. This is the bathroom that's uh, uh, half a block, uh, you know, up from the Hilton. We're on the, we're on the opposite side, though. The Hilton's downtown side. Here you can see all the uh, smeary, disgusting. I don't know if I, you know, there's an, enough light here. If we're, we're really getting it, I should, you know, let's, uh, shoot uh, shoot the video with the flash going or something like that. But uh, they have a real security guard over there, so they don't have to worry about uh, you know black murderous thugs. Uh, the two guys who attacked me in the lobby um, seven, uh, 16 and a half weeks ago with the black pit bull. They could be outside my door right now. They could be waiting for me. Again, this is a kind of a, a hostile uh, old guy that I was uh, you know trying to. Uh, uh, help be be an educated uh, digital person and be able to function function in today's society. Instead, he wants to be a drunk and uh, is a vodka alcoholic and all that stuff. And uh, uh, they say you can't help people like that. And that's you know you need to really top professionals. You know Dr. Phil and people like that. You know have them go through rehab and uh, part of the process is relapse and all that stuff. And regular people, you know, like me, we don't have the kind of patience for people like that. I mean, you got you got to almost love somebody like that, or they got to be paying you a lot of money or something. All right, so again, we have the jackhammers and whatever they got going out there. Uh, who knows if, if they're doing any good or damage or whatever it is. I'm just glad, uh, I, you know, my, my apartment is right, right nearby there. Okay, we have these uh, mangy, uh, uh, disgusting curtains over here. Uh, mold. There's uh, nobody who leaves the things on for a lot like they should be. Uh, somebody did just now. I'm going to get this horrifying, disgusting show up in that way. At least since yesterday. Oh, is that a cockroach yesterday? Yes, it is. Uh, Make a move. Let's see. Uh, the evidence says what that really is. It's going around. Uh, I, should, I should try to kill him before he goes. <coughs> All right, he's got away. Right, I'm going to stuff like this. Uh, Pretend they got a camera system. 